Scottish protester holding, abolish monarch, sign arrested during King Charles III declaration. A woman held up an, abolish monarchy, sign during the proclamation ceremony for King Charles III in Edinburgh A woman in Edinburgh, Scotland who held a sign reading, F, imperialism, abolish monarchy, was arrested Sunday during the formal declaration of King Charles III's accession to the throne. The woman was escorted away by police, eliciting mixed reactions. One man shouted, let her go. It's free speech, while others shouted, have some respect. Still, there was some booing in Edinburgh when Joseph Morrow, Lord Leone King of Arms, finished his proclamation with, God save the King. One attendee, 48-year-old Anne Hamilton, told the Associated Press she was offended by the protesters, saying, there's tens of thousands of people here today to show their respect. For them to be here, heckling through things, I think it was terrible, she said. If they were so against it, they shouldn't have come. Still, it was a sign of how some, including people in Britain's former colonies, are struggling with the legacy of the monarchy, and its future. Crowds of people packed the Royal Mile to get a glimpse of Queen Elizabeth II's flag-draped coffin. The procession was a huge event for Scotland as the UK takes days to mourn its longest reigning monarch. People turned out hours early to grab a space by the police barricades in Edinburgh. By afternoon, the crowds were ten people deep. In a somber, regal procession, Queen Elizabeth II's flag-draped coffin was driven slowly through the Scottish countryside Sunday from her beloved Balmoral Castle to the Scottish capital of Edinburgh. Mourners packed city streets and highway bridges or lined rural roads with cars and tractors to take part in a historic goodbye to the monarch who had reigned for 70 years.